she's definitely responding to some of the louder uh, mm-hmm. noisemakers. We even got her to respond to one of the softer noisemakers and to loud speech sounds. The pig. Yeah, she's very interested in the pig. Let me just make a few changes. There it was. Hi! Did you hear it? You heard it. I heard it. Did you? <laughs> yeah, you heard it with your implant. Very good. Yeah, do you want to try? Can you do it? You want to hold it? Logan, you can do it. Touch it. Yeah, you hold it. Yeah. Look, you want to bang it? Oh, you can bang it against right? the book. Yeah. <gasps> Yay, Logan! Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Good girl. Is that fun? Let's see. Oh, Did you peek? That's okay. Got my little chicky. Mm-hmm. Okay. Eyebrow went up. She heard it. She just didn't turn. So I was going to see if she would turn. That's right. You heard it. Yeah. Good girl. You want to do it? Yeah. Here, you do it. You want to hold it? See? <gasps> That's right. Good listening. Good listening. Here, you want to look at the cow? I know, I know. You like the cow. Very busy. Here, look. Touch it. That's it. Yep, that's the cow. <laughs> there it is. Did you hear that? That's right. You heard it. Very good. Mm-hmm. Let me make one more change. Right. You shake it? Shake, shake, shake. Yeah. You shake it? You hold it. Shake, shake, shake. I'm going to turn her off for just one second and make a few other changes. It turned off for a second. Okay. She looked up at you. She looked at you. Yeah. <laughs> you heard that one. <laughs> Good listening. Good girl. You heard it. Yeah. <laughs> you want to do it? Yeah. No, no, oh, no. Okay. <laughs> it's not a lollipop.
Bang, bang. I hear it. Yeah. Good job. Yeah. Yeah. Here, look right here. Look what you're doing. Can you see your eyes? Yeah, they got real big. <laughs> Hi. Yeah. I know you see that one. So <laughs> fine. So this is where we keep Logan's backup batteries. You can see these are charged and these are charging. And then we just cycle these out. We have six total for both implants. And then at night, you separate the battery from the microphone and the coil. You're going to take both of those parts and you put them in this Zephyr drying storage. You just put them in this compartment right here, and this is the drying brick. And then once they're in there at night, you just turn it on so that way they stay nice and dry. There's no moisture. Um, but right now she's napping, so that's why they're not in there. And just some little extras. So we used to pay tape for Logan. So this is all pre-cut little strips that we use every day. And then this is all the excess paper. And then this is actually the toupee tape from the end of the day, all wadded up. Um, I have a backup battery in here. It's actually uh, damaged, but just in case. And then this is another um, USB charger for those two wires. And then... We actually have two drying bricks because her surgeries were um, separate. So we have one just in case and then we have the one that's currently out. And then these are the drying bricks that I use. And you're supposed to replace these, um, I believe it's every two months. They have a, a space on there where you can write it in. And you just remove that film, pop it in there, write the date. Easy. So this is all the equipment for the, for the cochlear implant devices. Um, Logan had her right surgery and then her left, so this was broken up into two um, packs, I guess you could say. And at surgery, we were given this backpack that was completely full. Um, zipper almost couldn't close, it was so full. And this had all of her equipment for us to take to her audiologist who checked over it. And then Logan got this little koala. So she has two backpacks and two little koala buddies that have their um, CIs. So let me show you all of this equipment. These are the traveling cases that come with it. Um, these two are the bulkier ones, the fabric covered, and they have uh, the tool in there for any fixes, and then all these really nice spaces for all the different components. Um, the one that we use is the smaller black one. She has two of these as well, but we use it for school um, so her backups and everything are in this little bag along with batteries just in case her uh, rechargeable batteries die. So that's what she takes to school. And these are the activity kits. These are the waterproof kits. Um, we use this during the summer for swimming and Logan did really well with it. So as you can tell, I'll show you this top part. These are the activity kits. That silicone cover just pops right over the CI. You slide it in there, it fits really well. And then you attach the waterproof coil um, instead of the coil that you have. Um, and then we also have a little string on there to keep it from uh, falling off her. So that is the activity kit. And then of course this has backups as well. Um, and so we got two of those per ear. So we have four total of those. And then we have two mini mics. We got one mini mic per ear. And um, we use this in the car. We use it at the grocery store. Um, we just keep it in the diaper bag. And I also keep the charger with me as well. And then in the diaper bag, I also keep, this is a, this is so nice to have. This is a USB charger. So you put the battery, the rechargeable battery on that side and then that's just the USB port and you can plug it in and charge um, one at a time just in case anything happens. So there's that. And then the mini mic, that's what we travel with, obviously besides the actual CIs. 
and I don't even remember what's in here. Oh yeah, these are the actual battery packs. So if you're gonna use proper disposable batteries, um, these are the batteries and then you pop them into these little cells. And I think there's more, yeah. So like I mentioned before, this is what is in Logan's backup bag so we don't have rechargeable batteries just sitting in there. And this should have, yeah. And that's the remote. We don't use that remote for her devices. And then in these bigger boxes, I consolidated this. So this is not how they came, but this is all the equipment. So you're gonna have like serial number information, um, microphone, or not microphone, earphone adapters, um, cables, just all this extra stuff that's gonna come with it. Like your audiologist will go over each and every detail with you. Um, these are little ear hooks. You're gonna have all your backup microphones, your backup ear hooks. Um, what else? These are the microphone covers. And like I said, when we first got this, we were super overwhelmed. Like you're like, this is so much stuff, you know, we're gonna not know what to do with it, but you'll know what to do with it. It comes natural. So these are the Aqua Plus coils that go with the waterproof um, silicone covers. And then that's another USB battery charger. Um, that's the serial number information. Um, you get the uh, USB power adapter. see microphone covers um, ear hooks small and large the charger and then that little pen let me see what's in this one okay so this one I okay so that's what I did all of the equipment is in this one for me and then all of the manuals <laughs> are in here and then another uh, charger. So let me show you. Let me show you the manual because you would think that it would be super annoying. So this is the actual manual for the Nucleus 7. You, you open it up and it is all electronic. It is so nice, it's so easy to use. Um, you can power through everything with the buttons. It is, it, ma it makes it so much easier to know what you're looking for and what you're trying to find. So that's been super helpful. Um, so we have two of those, obviously one per ear as well. But yeah, everything, <laughs> everything in its place, kind of, sort of. There's a lot of information and I'm sure some of this, um, depending on what, what you get with your kit, um, you won't have all of this, but just for an overview. That's what we chose, the activity kits and the mini microphones. So yeah, it looks like a lot, but it's totally, totally manageable. Like I mentioned earlier, this is Logan's backup bag. Um, the school provides these little baggies, um, transparent baggies for the students. And then um, we check this in every day. And so the teachers and everyone has backup equipment if anything fails. And you can see it says two processors, two cables, two coils, and two batteries. So let me show you what we keep in here and what we travel with all the time. So this is what actually stays in the backup bag, the disposable batteries. I keep a, a pack in there um, just for safety and since we don't use it any other time. And then in her little case, I have a little baggie of toupee tape that needs to be refilled. And then I have the two batteries. These are the battery packs that take the disposable batteries. I have um, the coils, ca um, cables, and processors, um, and then they're right and left. And on here, they actually have the sticker, right is red, blue is left, um, so that way the teachers know. And that's what goes with us everywhere. 